What a putrid offering. Natural sciences, linguistics, archaeology. I should get rid of all this stuff. It's been a while since I jotted down something other than my nightmares. Wentworth. 
I'm calling because of a problem with your file. A fire has destroyed some of our documents. Is that right? I'm so very sorry, but I have to collect your personal information yet again. What's wrong? As you know, we wish to closely monitor the progress of our contractors. And it would seem you've been accepting fewer new cases. Work is scarce. Mr. Pierce, you know as well as I do there's never been more investigative work than now. But are those cases worth it? They're worth not losing your license. Show yourself worthy of the Wentworth Detective Agency, and we might keep you on the payroll. Mr. Pierce, are you still I'm coming. <laughs> Sir, I came here on the advice of a person whom I hold in high esteem. And I must say that I expected anything but a drunkard's lair. You're free to leave any time, sir. Do you know to whom you speak? Stephen Webster, industrialist and art collector. <laughs> All of Boston knows you. Tell me, Mr. Pierce, are you capable of handling a new case, or are you simply a deadbeat inebriate? If you come to me, it means you're desperate. Nobody believes me. They take me for an old fool. Sarah, my little girl, she is dead. Even you must know of her. She was Sarah Hawkins. The painter? Yes. Everyone knows her work. The police accuse her of killing her family. They all died in a fire. Sarah, her husband, and Simon, my grandson. I can't do anything for a woman who is already dead. Find out the truth. They say she was mad, but I know that's a lie. She would never have done such a thing. But if you have no proof... I've brought all that I have. Look. I want you to look carefully at this painting. Tell me all the assumptions that come to mind. What am I supposed to find? Tell me... Tell me if this is the work of madness. Or if, on the contrary, you manage to detect some logic, a rationality to follow so that I may understand it. Is that all you want from me? Yes, please. All right. I'll look at your picture. That's all you've got? The painting? I placed a file on your desk. It contains everything I have on the affair. It's as if Sarah Hawkins breathed a message into it.
A warehouse on Darkwater. Some sketches of the Hawkins family. Rather thin. So, Mr. Pierce, what do you make of these elements? The meaning could be exactly as it appears. I think your daughter is sending you a message. That's what I believe, too. It was three months ago that I received the call from the police telling me of my daughter's death. And yet a short while after, this painting was delivered to my home. The painting is linked to this case, can't you see? You must find the meaning behind all this. You must tell me if what the police suggest about the mental state of your daughter is true. No. Sarah had visions. Everyone knew that. She never would have heard a fly. She only thought she saw things. Saw things? What do you mean by that? I never knew what she meant by that. My daughter was an enigmatic figure, Mr. Pierce. You must find out the truth about her life and death. Darkwater? Never heard of the place. Where is that? It's a small, remote island off the coast of Boston. Sarah lived there with her son and her husband. I suppose you want to ship me off there. Darkwater holds the secret regarding my daughter, Mr. Pierce. You must uncover it. The sender's label mentions Warehouse 36. That's right. It came with Sarah's last painting. And you think your daughter could have been the sender? That is what you must find out. Go to Darkwater. Find Warehouse 36. Her husband was a big deal on the island. But the police are sticking to the accident theory. Though they mentioned Sarah's mental state was fragile. I believe you are right, sir. This case is not as simple as it appears. I am aware of that. I believe there is more to this case than just an accident. I think I'm beginning to understand. I'm willing to do anything for my daughter to recover her honor. Quiet down. I'm on your side. Let's sum things up. An artist dies with her family in a house fire. Your only clue is a sort of promontory painting sent from dark water right before her death. Correct. And the rumors about her supposed folly. Which you don't totally deny. Find that warehouse. Find out the truth regarding Sarah Hawkins' death. You'll be handsomely compensated. All right. I'll take the case. I'll go to Darkwater and look into the death of your daughter. Thank you, Mr. Pierce. I didn't expect any less coming from a man in your situation. Something's queer. But it's not like I have a choice. Dark water. I think I've got a book on the North Atlantic. I'll no doubt find some information on this island in there.
I used to be an avid reader. Dark water is off the coast of Boston, but I've never heard of it. According to this book, it was often mentioned during whale hunting times at the end of the 19th century, but it seems to have been shunned since then. All I have to do is go to the port. I just hope that I can find a boat able to take me to dark water. Natural sciences, linguistics, archaeology, Stay on board. There's guys coming to unload. Welcome to Darkwater Island, Mr. Pierce. Why, thank you, Captain Fitzroy. So, what wind brought you? Does the Hawkins case mean anything to you? Ah, a sad story that we would all prefer to forget. Charles Hawkins may have been a landlubber, but he was a good man. And his wife, Sarah Hawkins. A ah, nice young woman, and a great painter. What a tragedy. You know what? Go have a drink of the stranded whale. What you need is a good pick-me-up. Mitchell may not be very welcoming, but his bar holds a surprise for you. As for me, you'll find me at the Harbormaster's office. 
If it's the Hawkins family that brings you here, I have a pile of documents that should interest you. Understood. I'm going for a look around the docks. Hey, Sullivan, can't you go any faster? You see how old this thing is? If we force it too much, we'll break everything. You can't do that. But it's only a fish. A fish? You've got no idea. Don't badmouth what you don't know. Or you'll pay for it for sure. Okay, that's enough. Step back and let us do our job. That's no way to treat an omen. Oh, yeah. He's gonna get us into trouble. You can't understand. You're not sailors. It's a sign. There's something coming. Something real bad. Don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters. You're crazy. They're cops. They can't understand. Damn stupid idiots. Forget it. Nobody listens to us anyway. That's no way to treat an omen. Oh, yeah. He's gonna get us into trouble. The blood is just beginning to coagulate. It died a short time ago. Only a specialist would know what killed it. Don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters! You're crazy! They're cops. They can't understand. Dick the same goes for you, sir. Move along. I'm looking for this address. Warehouse 36. Darkwater Harbor. Ah. And so who are you? I didn't introduce myself. Edward Pierce, private detective. In any case, it's not very important. I can't answer that. You can't? Or you don't want to? Oh, no, no. I'm not getting into those games, me. Now, please, allow me to do my job. You don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters! You can see that I'm busy, can't you? You That's can't no understand. You're not no sailors. Man. Oh yeah. It's a sign. He's gonna There's get us There's something trouble. Something real bad. Don't put that beast back in the water, you shysters! You're crazy. Prohibition is just a joke around here. That suits me fine. Let's get him another drink. He's dry. In my bar, we don't serve troublemakers. Boys, 
pure instinct. I behaved like a Hun, and I sincerely apologize. Veteran, huh? 307th Infantry Regiment. Oh. Well, that'll be okay for now. But the war is over. Try not to forget it. I'm here for information, not for a fight. I prefer it that way. Speak then. I reserve the right to answer or not. I didn't expect to find alcohol on this island. What's the source of this miracle? You mean who? Our source of supply wouldn't like me to betray them to the first comer. I'll tell nobody. She'd know it anyway. Anything else? What can you tell me about her? We all knew she was famous on the mainland for her paintings. Never understood why. Then, I don't want to speak ill of the dead. Her style made her famous. How would you describe it? Tortured? Yeah. Well, it wasn't normal. I mean, for a young woman with a child and all that. We saw them in the papers and we said to ourselves, who can paint such things? Is that how she sees the world? So they made you feel uncomfortable? You need to see them for yourself. Make up your own mind. Her vision. Was it so terrible? The way I see it, the truth is really a question of point of view. What do you mean by that? Do you still trust the truth after a bottle of whiskey? I've got what I need. Anything else? The Stranded Whale. I guess this bar has been here a long time. What can I tell you? I'm a nostalgic sort of guy. The name, it reminds us of the golden age of dock water, when our whalers left for long months and came back, sweating and stinking of the oil and flesh of the whales they'd been hunting. It was a tough time, all the same. Ah, but steeped in glory. We've never known such wealth since then. Captain Fitzroy told me about a little pick-me-up. You want a drink? I wouldn't say no to a glass. Try this. I think we'll get along well. Do you know where this place is? Warehouse 36, Darkwater Harbor. The Hawkins Warehouse. I see, yeah. If I were you, I wouldn't hang around there. Why not? First off, there are rumors. Sailors from around here say you can hear noises coming from the warehouse at night. Screams, that sort of thing. Screams? And that's not all. There's the fate of its owners and all the superstitions that go with it. But I'll say no more. Anything else? That'll be all for now. What you looking at, stranger? The clientele is predominantly male. Tell me something I don't know. I meant nothing by it. I'm just wondering what a woman like you is doing in this flea trap. And I'm wondering what could be going through the head of the chump who goes to disturb her. Let me drink, stranger. Do 
you like our song? <laughs> We're true sirens. We may not be pros, but we give it all we've got. That's true. It's a reminder of the time when we were still fishing for whales off Darkwater Island. <laughs>